and then you're going to hit 7 and 8. And when you're playing for Shante style, you really have to practice. Um, he really percusses the strings. He hits all the strings, but only lets the one ring out that he wants to play. So when he does that, he goes. He's hitting all of them, but only the ones he wants are ringing out. And that's really going to give you the first Shante sound versus. It just doesn't sound like what you're going to want it to sound like. So. You come over top with the thumb, hit the top string, and then you bar the three strings in the middle there. And then do a hammer on up to the nine. And then bring that whole formation down to the five. And he does the fill at the end. That's just five seven five seven. And then you slide back up after that to repeat. Then this one is different because it slides up to the nine. So that again goes. Then up to the. And then the other fill. And then when you play that to make it sound like him, you really... So to do that, you got to make sure you have your thumb over the top muting this top string, and then your other fingers draped across to mute these so that you really can hit it and make that um, fill ring out. And the, the next one goes thumb over the top again. And then we're going to hammer on up to the 10. Then the fill here. So you bend up with that, hit the 8, finish like we did the other one, and then the next part up to 7, 9, 9, 7, and then these two open. So then at the end of that one, and then this chord is putting your pinky up there on the 10. And then this one you really kind of just strum through it. So let's do that again. So this is thumb over the top on the 12, 14, then you bar 12, 12, and then this is up the pinkies on 15. So when you just strum through it, and then this, and that is a bend up, bring it down, and make sure you pull off. Like that, so. So that's. 
then this chord is it's the same structure as this one and same thing strum through it and this is a slight variation when you come back down to that instead of putting the pinky on the 10 you're going to put it up on the 10 on the first string so again going back down through that hammering on with that pinky back to that chord we already made then you start with the pinky on 10 pull off and then goes up to the first string and that's it so I didn't include me actually playing it because if you want to watch that you can just go watch Frashante play it um, hopefully that was helpful if you still have any questions drop me a comment